Sugar waxing has been around for ages, and all it takes to make it is white sugar, water, and lemon juice. You don't even need to use waxing strips or sticks to wax, but they can be helpful at times. Sugar waxing is much cheaper than buying hair removal wax at the store. Sugar wax is also extremely easy to clean up, and the wax itself dissolves with water, and dissolves even quicker with warm water. Step 1, pour sugar in a pan. Step 2, add water. Step 3, add lemon juice. Step 4, stir and turn on high heat. Step 5, once it's boiling or bubbling reduce heat to medium step 6 you want it to lightly produce bubbles but if it starts bubbling up like step 5 then lower the heat a bit and make sure you constantly stir step 7 once it starts to get golden in color turn off heat and take a spoon full of wax and put it in your fridge to test consistency once it's cooled it should be thicker than honey you should be able to put it in your hand and roll it around if it's still too runny or sticky bring back to medium low heat for a few more minutes and test again step 8 once you have the right consistency pour into a bowl and allow to cool for about 30 minutes just check on it after 30 minutes and if it still is too warm or hot wait a bit longer how to apply using a butter knife spoon your hands or a thick wooden popsicle stick scoop out a glob of wax and roll into a bowl for legs i generally make a golf ball size wax ball but for smaller areas you would need less, press the ball onto the area you need to wax, and using your palm and fingers, or using a popsicle stick flatten out the wax over the area you are waxing, until the wax is about 1 43rd thick. Waxing tips for underarms I tend to apply a small amount of baby powder to absorb the moisture prior to waxing. For more tender areas like underarms, or if you are waxing bikini line it helps to pull the skin, and then apply the wax to ease pain apply pressure with your hands to just waxed area if you do need to remove the wax just run it under warm hot water until it dissolves 